So in this video we will talk about mobile testing and actually when you look at the overview at the test cycle of mobile testing you will approximately see it the same as computer test cycle nothing different except this part well when you go to mobile testing it's not the same one you know mission that you have to do I mean in the computer test cycle you just had to test on the web test the website on your computer and that's it but in the mobile test cycle it's not the same we have different platforms and you can test only one of them or maybe you can test several ones so let's see how did that variation come to this cycle well in this cycle you are ordered to test on a mobile so maybe you have an android mobile or maybe you have an ios device well if you have an android then the android testing will not even be just you know on one side no you can test the website or maybe you can test also the application so you have to choose one of them and test and test it but actually maybe you can test both of them and actually maybe you can test on the android and on the ios device if you have both of them well of course I recommend you look for the easiest one but if you want to practice well then go ahead and test on different platforms however in Android testing if you are going to test the website then you have to understand how to capture a log on Chrome so this is something that we are going to explain in this video and the second thing if you have an application then you have to understand also how to capture a log from an application and something from the one of the you know I mean the complicated things about Android that it's very very different to a capture log in website on a website or an application the second thing that we will take about Android is that um, what are the video recorders you can use for Android of course we have two the AZ uh, recorder and the mobizen recorder and we will understand how each of them work well the second thing that you will take is iOS testing and in iOS testing it's the same I mean you can either test the website or maybe you can test the application so it's your choice but here the matter is not so difficult in you know according to capturing the log just like in the Android mobile testing no it's more simple and I will tell you how that actually we are going to capture log maybe using iTunes or iTools but what I recommend from my experience that the shortest and simplest way to capture log is through iTools so I will tell you how to work on iTools it's very very easy and the step is very simple just one step maybe to capture a log from your iOS application or website the second thing that we are going to take is actually how to record a video for iOS and maybe this takes you know uh, several uh, steps it's not that easy that you will record the, web, the, the website or an application through the recorder of your iPhone or iPad no there is another way which I managed to tell you that in which you can use the lonely screen which is recommended also in the handbook and at the same time you can use your ice cream recorder on your uh, laptop and you will tell me now what is the relation between the ice cream recorder which is for the uh, computer or the laptop with uh, recording my iOS device well the lonely screen is not actually a recorder it's a, a mirroring application it means that it mirrors or shares the screen of your iOS on the laptop and what I mean here to get a video that is already com compressed and that doesn't have a lot of space that you have to compress after that you can use the lonely screen and from the lonely screen uh, you can turn on the ice cream recorder at the same time and the ice cream recorder will you know just take the uh, shape 
of your computer and it, it, it will not record the video just like it's so live in the iOS it will record it as if there is something like pictures that is going on on the screen and it will not take too much size but at the same time it will preserve a good quality of your video we will see that together by experimentation and I mean by uh, trying it lively here so let's go ahead 